Hi everyone, I'm Liu Xiaoxuan from Group 4, and here are my group mates. Our purpose of writing this program is to ease the user to manage their bookshop. Current list of book with book ID, name, and author name, and also the total number of the books will be displayed. How can this program help? It helps to save time to check one by one, employ fewer workers to manage the bookshop, and also lower the bookshop model. How the program works? Firstly, the program will show the current list of books. Users can add new book record by inserting several details. New book record will be displayed. Lastly, users can enhance or delete the book records if needed. Good morning, doctor. My name is Chu Wei Lun, and now. It's my part to have an explanation about the variable and explanation of our program. Firstly, our program starts with a list of header found which is IRStream, FStream, String, DSDDlib, CSDDO, and also IRMANIP. For FStream, it mainly describes the found stream. It is used to handle the data being read from a, as, from a file as input or data being written into a file as output. Okay, besides, the header file we use is CSDDlib. The library is needed to access the file. Then, CS Studio is the library that mainly used to remove and rename a file. We use it in our delete book function and also enhance book function. For the other library, is the normal normal library. Okay, so for our white function, we got short record, control panel, add book, display book, enhance book, and also delete book. At the first part of our program, we call up our main function first, which is int main. Then we call display book function and uh, to show current book list and we call shop record function after it. Okay, so the first white function is shop record function. This function allows user to choose the selection from control panel with enter and integer. So at first we declare selection as integer and also a as character. Next we compute a while loop and require user to insert the selection. After that. We use switch case selection to proceed the program run with different selection from user. For case 1, is run our add book void function. After that, we do also require user to insert y or n to decide whether to run the add book function again or not. Okay, so case 2 is run the display book function. Case 3 for enhance book function. Case 4 for delete book function. And the last case 5 is exit the program. If user insert selection out of range of 1 to 5, the system will show invalid selection. Okay, so next, it is our control panel function. At first, we use system CLS to reset the code so show in the, in the new screen. Hence, we use manipulator function from Almanip library to design our control panel. User can see clearly what is inside the control panel, which is our different white function. And the last one is exit the program. That's all for my part. I will pass to my group member. Thank you. Good morning, doctor. So I will continue explaining the variable and explanation for our program. I will explain void function, function at book first. This function start with system CLS and open a file bookshop text. Then this function enables the user to enter the book ID, number, name, and also the author's name of the book. We use get line cin string string ends uh, to en enable the user to key in the name and author's name of the book that are more than one character. Before the file is closed, we can see that at the line 137, the program will store all the information of the book into the file. I will continue explaining another work function, function display book. The function will open the file that stored before it. Uh, to display the information of the book. If the system cannot detect the file bookshop text, so it cannot read the data, then the output will show file opening error. If the system detect the file bookshop text successfully, it will show the book list in the file. At the line 171 until the line 180, uh, we use while wow loop to enable the program to continuously display the information of the book until it reaches the end of the file. Lastly, the file will be closed. That's all for me. I will pass to my group member. Thank you. Hello doctor, I would like to explain the word and has book function. Actually, this function we refer from the internet. First, we call the display book function. Then next, we, we declare all the variables inside this uh, function. 
then system CL enhance the bulk, then system open a file one that the file is open in output mode, then the second file is open in input mode. If the file cannot find in the system, a system will see our file opening error. Else that if the file can find, system will see our book ID and user is asked to see in the book ID. Then the system will read the data from the file, which call book shop txt. Next part is while loop. The while loop will end until the file is reached. Then I will explain this file with an example when the book ID is in just now is 8003, but the system run is line by line from 8001 to 8003. So that system will check 8001 first. Uh, 8001 is not same with the bulk ID delete. Uh, system will go to the else and then output the data to the file one and then read the data again from the file two 8002 also not same. They will repeat until read 8003 is same with the bulk ID delete. System will see out update book record. Then see out new number of book. User is need to see new number of book. See out new book name. User see in new book name. Uh, system see out new auto name, user see in new auto name, then uh, the data that see in just now, the uh, system will output to the file 1 and then continue until the end of the loop. If the count is equal to 0, system will see our book ID not file. After that, system will close the file and then file 1 also close. Then system will remove the bookshop txt and then rename the bookshop 1 txt to bookshop txt. Next is why delete book function. Uh, actually, why the label function is almost same with the why enhance book function. So the first part is totally same with the why enhance book function. Next is the while loop part. Actually, just this while loop part is different. When the book ID same with the book ID delete, system will see how delete a book and then see how book ID is delete successfully. Just this part, this part is different from the why enhance book. That's all from me. Thank you. I'll be in charge of explain how the code run i click the run first and the back screen will display the letters through this next the control panel will appear now let's say the user want to add book he need to click the button one then need to enter a book id just example i create s004 the number of book i click one for the book name i type atomic habit then alternate i type james clear it will display a center which is we want to enter again if i want to add another book i place y if not i key in n and i will return to the control panel now I key in 2, then the letters full list will be displayed. Next, if the user needs to enhance book, key in 3 and firstly the letters full list will be displayed. Then the user needs to key in the book ID of book which he want to enhance. If I click a book ID which does not exist in the letters full list, a sentence book ID not found will be displayed. And I need to go back to control panel to key in 3 again to enter the function. So now, if I want to change the details of book ID X004, I key in X004. It will ask a new total number of book, then I click 2 and the new book name I type compound effect. And also author name Dayton Hardy. Then the user can key in 2 to see that the details of book ID X004 had changed. Now, if the user want to delete book, key in 4. It will display a letter put list to us for us to decide whether which book to delete. If I want to delete the book compound effect, I need to key in X004 and then it will display a sentence book is deleted successfully. Then the user key in 2 to see the data full list and the user will find that the book ID X004 has been deleted. Then if the user has completed all the tasks, he can key in 5 to create the program. It's all of me. Thank you. After this assessment, we found something new and combined the knowledge that we have learned in the classes. Besides created a program that required, we learned to cooperate with each other, we discuss about the problems that face and find the ways to dissolve it. Although we had some arguments along the way, but we work them out and get closer. If something similar happens in the future, arguments can be avoided and resolved quickly. Thank you.